वेलकम गाइस वी ऑल नो दैट एयरपोर्ट्स आर वन ऑफ द बिजिएस्ट मोड ऑफ ट्रांसपोर्टेशन थाउजेंड्स ऑफ पीपल फ्लाई टूवर्ड्स द डेस्टिनेशन एंड हंड्रेड्स ऑफ फ्लाइट विल टेक ऑफ ईच डे रेगुलर अनाउंसमेंट अलॉन्ग विद मिनट टू मिनट अराइवल एंड डिपार्चर शेड्यूल्स फ्रॉम चेकिंग काउंटर्स एंड सिक्योरिटी चेक्स टू बोर्डिंग गेट्स ईच स्टेप इज डिजाइन टू प्रोवाइड ए सेफ एंड स्मूथ ट्रैवल एक्सपीरियंस फॉर द पैसेंजर्स इन दिस वीडियो लेट अस ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड हाउ टेक्नोलॉजी प्ले एन इंपॉर्टेंट रोल इन मैनेजिंग एवरीथिंग फ्रॉम बुकिंग टू फ्लाइट टिकट टू एयर ट्रैफिक कंट्रोल एंड हाउ इन फ्लाइट एंटरटेनमेंट सिस्टम वर्क थ्रू एडवांस नेटवर्क इन डिवाइस In my previous video I have clearly explained that how networking device play an important role in forwarding your data to internet using the campus network for example not only in the campus same fundamental design is applicable for your office buildings hospitals banks and airports if anyone missed that video I have included a link in the description for you to check out now let us begin our journey with flight booking system suppose you are planning to book a flight from hyderabad to dubai you can use official website or any third party apps to book your flight ticket for example let's say you decided to book your flight to dubai using official website now you can open your browser and start typing emirates.com your browser send request to emirates web server here emirates represent the domain similarly when you type facebook.com youtube.com instagram.com these url represent that you are connecting to a particular domains but hold on who is sitting at the back of the computer connecting you to emirates.com not only emirates if you want to connect to the facebook or if you want to connect to the youtube you may know the domain names domain names are simple and memorable especially made for humans so we can easily remember to access websites services and information but machines can't able to understand what is the meaning of facebook and what is the meaning of emirates in this case dns domain name system plays an important role to connecting us to particular domains when you search for emirates.com your browser send a request to the dns server to find the particular ip address linked with emirates.com the dns server looks for the matching ip address once found you return the ip address to your computer later on Your computer send a HTTP request to the Emirates web server and in response the Emirates server sends web pages to your computer now you can access the entire Emirates website on your computer it's time to search for a flight go to your search bar enter hyderabad in departure section and dubai in arrival section plan your departure date and click search for flights your computer send additionally HTTP request to Emirates web server to retrieve information and then it tracks with the Emirates database which contain all flight information once your request match the results are displayed directly on your computer so what is the database database is a gpt meter one is from our gpt table if i'm missing and it's called database A database is a organized collection of structured information or a data typically stored electronically in a computer system is called a database. It's time for you to make a choice. Select a flight that suits for your time and budget and don't forget to consider your baggage needs. Enter your personal details and complete the remaining steps. After making the payment, all your details are securely stored in a Emirates database. Finally, your booking is confirmed. Check your email for booking status confirmation and now it's time to prepare for your journey. Go for shopping, pack your bags and if you are a vlogger, grab your camera, shoot everything and make a vlog capturing your travel to Dubai. Three ways you can collect your boarding pass. First option is to collect your boarding pass at your home by logging into Emirates website before departure. Your device send a request to the home router which then forward the request to your internet service provider. Your ISP establishes a connection to the Emirates web server. Now you can enter your login details and the Emirates web server interact with the database. Once your details match, your boarding pass travel back towards the same path to your mobile device. When you are at the airport you can find a check-in kiosk machines where you can collect the boarding pass you can either enter your booking details or you can scan passport these kiosk machines interact with the database to retrieve information once your detail match it prints your boarding pass and updates the database that you have checked in a full service checking counter with airline staffs is available to help you with the checking process The staff manually enters your information into the airline's computer system which then interact with the database to retrieve information once your detail match the airline staff prints your boarding pass and the database updated that you have checked in on the other side your Emirates Airbus is getting ready for departure it undergoes routine checks servicing fueling cockpit preparation and cleaning most of the planes store fuel in the wings so that engine below can use it throughout the journey emirates airlines submit important information about your flight to air traffic controller this include flight number aircraft type departure time passenger details this information is submitted to air traffic controller before departure for general information after 9 by 11 attacks
Airport around the world has changed its security system to keep us safe. CCTV cameras were installed. You need to take out your electronics and wallet. You need to remove your shoes, watch, jacket before scanning. Airport body scanners use advanced technology for safe and quick security checks. Some new airports you face scanners for added security. After completing your security skins, you can check your flight information in a centralized flight information system throughout the airport. Despite finding your flight number, you notice that the gate number is not yet displayed. After reviewing the flight information, ATC looks for particular risks and issues such as weather conditions and airspace availability. If everything is clear, ATC communicates with CFF to update its database with flight details, gate number and departure time so the passenger can easily locate the gate with the updated information. Communication between the ATC and CFS is facilitated using standardized protocol like Aeronautical Telecommunication Network or Aeronautical Fixed Telecommunication Protocol. As you walk with other passengers toward the gate, staff call you based on the group number. They check your boarding pass, enter details in the computer that connects the database, and if everything matches, you're clear to board. Meanwhile, air traffic controller communicates with flight crew members for safe and smooth departure process. So now you are sitting relaxed on your seat enjoying your meal, but you need entertainment. For this you have in-flight entertainment system. A dedicated server place on the board holding variety of content like TV shows, music, games and movies. You can access all of this right in the front of your display, ensuring that each and every passenger enjoy the entertainment throughout the journey. This system works with the onboarding Wi-Fi. Some modern flights provide internet connectivity for passengers through satellite communication system. The aircraft is equipped with two satellite antennas. One antenna is located on the bottom of the aircraft, is used for upstream communications. Passengers and aircraft system can send data through these antennas where you can upload your data to internet which is sent to ground based system this includes sending message or other information from aircraft to ground another one is located at the top of the aircraft is used for downstream communications they enable the aircraft to receive data from ground stations through satellites these include receive email streaming content Kuka band frequency used to transfer your data between aircraft and ground stations. I hope you got a clear vision about how internet is useful through your flight journey. Key device in the video is server, in nothing but a dedicated component. If it is web server, it will give website when we request. If it is DNS server, it will connect to a particular website. Or if it is file server, it is store our files and documents. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section below. Thank you.